Episode 2 Pre-Check and Starting and Stopping Operating the Peterbilt Model 579 EV is very similar to operating the internal combustion Model 579. However, there are some important differences that make the 579 EV unique. A pre-check for this model starts with typical pre-trip inspection items that apply to all trucks. Make sure all wheel nuts are properly torqued and wheel nut caps are in place. Check the function of all exterior lights. Make sure there is no coolant or fluid leaking on the ground. And check all fluid and air lines, their connections, and that they are secure and not chafing. There are three separate coolant circuits on the 579 EV. There is one for the power electronics and E-axle motors, one for cabin heat, and one for the battery system. The power electronics and E-axle motor coolant reservoir and cabin heat reservoir fluid levels can be checked via the indicators molded into the translucent reservoirs. The battery chiller reservoir fluid level can be checked via the sight glass. If fluid can be seen in the sight glass, then there is adequate fluid. And make sure there is no debris in the radiator cooling fan. This completes the pre-trip inspection. The truck is ready to start. If necessary, remove the charger plug. Again, if necessary, switch the low voltage disconnect to on. Turn the key to the run position. Allow at least one minute for the truck to automatically run through all its starting checks before continuing to the ignition sequence. After the truck has completed the starting checks, turn the key clockwise fully and let it spring back to engage the ignition sequence. Now, truck running is indicated by the power gauge needle moving to the point that lies between the words charge and eco. The truck will be ready to move when the green ready to move telltale indicator is illuminated. Release the parking brake. Put the truck in drive or reverse using the column mounted stock. Now you are on the move. After your drive is complete, put the truck in neutral Pull the parking brake handle to apply the parking brake. Turn the key counterclockwise and remove the key from the ignition. Make sure that the ready to move telltale indicator is extinguished. Thank you for watching episode 2, pre-check and starting and stopping. To learn more about the Peterbilt Model 579 EV, please watch episode 3, charging and battery management.